Hello everyone, hope everyone is doing well. In this video, we are going to define the differences between accounting profit and economic profit. Accounting profit is the profit that we know. It is basically equals to revenues minus cost. <clears throat> now here we will cost, we will later define it a little differently, but we are basically going to call it explicit costs. So let's say I have a coffee shop and my coffee shop I'm producing, let's say just one product, which is latte. Revenue is basically what I earn. So how much money am I bringing in? And cost here, explicit cost is basically telling us what I spend to sell, or let's say not just sell, to produce and sell lattes. So in my case, let's say I produce um, 200 lattes and I sell for $5 per latte. So this is my earning. So I will earn my revenue would be 200 times $5, which would be $1,000. So basically, I'm earning $1,000 by selling 200 cups of latte for $5 per cup. Now, what do I spend, which is what I'm saying is explicit cost. This basically means it involves involves a monetary transaction. So basically, what do I need to produce lattes? So some of the costs that I may face are things like um, I need water, I need coffee beans, I need um, maybe some kind of a coffee or latte making machine like frother and coffee grinders and all those things. So I need some machines, I need a location, I need utilities and many other things. So those are all my explicit costs because I have to spend money in order to get all these things. Let's say that my explicit cost is going to be four dollars per cup so to produce those 200 cups i need to spend four dollars per cup so my cost is going to be basically four times 200 which is going to be 800 dollars now my accounting profit then there will be so accounting profit would be my revenue which is one thousand dollars minus my explicit cost which is eight hundred dollars which comes out to be $200. So this is what accountants report whenever they talk about profits or losses. So I'm earning $200 of profit from this coffee shop, let's say per day. Now economic profit, it's basically very similar to accounting profit, except that in the end we add another cost or we subtract another cost from accounting profit. So economic profit equals to, well, same revenues minus explicit cost minus implicit cost. Now implicit cost, this is going to be the value of my time. So in, a, in another, another case, or let's say, if you remember from a previous thing, um, we have talked about opportunity costs. So basically, this is going to be a side note, opportunity cost here equals explicit cost plus implicit cost. So basically economic profit is revenues minus my opportunity cost. I have a video on opportunity cost in my channel. So if you are kind of, if you have forgotten what opportunity cost is, please go and watch that video. The link is given below. So what is implicit cost here? The value of my time. What does that say? So let's say that if I did not own the coffee shop, I could have worked somewhere and earned, let's say, $15 per hour. So if I work eight hours a day, my income would be 15 times eight, which is $120. $120. So if that's the case, then my implicit cost is I'm giving up this amount. So this is the value of my time that I gave up in order to operate this business. So my economic profit would be the same revenues. So I still, I'm earning $1,000 of revenues. My explicit cost is going to be 800. My implicit cost is going to be 120. So then my economic profit is going to be $80. So this is telling us that even after accounting for the value of my time, I'm making $80 of economic profit. Now let's say instead of $15 an hour, let's say my time was actually much more valuable. So let's say if instead my wage that I am giving up is somewhere close to $40 an hour, then I then the value of my 
time, or my implicit cost, is 40 times 8, which is going to be $320. Now, if that's the case, then my economic profit would be, let me just write it here, my revenues would still be a thousand. Let's say minus my explicit cost is eight hundred. Now my implicit cost is three twenty, which means that it would be now my profit is economic profit is negative one hundred and twenty dollars. That means I am actually losing one hundred and twenty dollars if I am working in my own company. So in this case, it may be better for me to take up this job that pays me forty dollars an hour.